Greetings everyone, Jono here. <laughs> we meet again. Well, I'm back to talk about more awkward situations because I feel like a specialist in that field. Well, the first subject at hand is small talk, which I absolutely hate because if I want to talk to somebody, I typically just like want to get to the point. Uh, I'm not saying that I don't want to talk to people because if I want to talk to people, I want to know how their day is going and things like that. But I really don't like it when they're just talking about, well, you know, like so-and-so, you know, did something. But seriously, no one cares about what so-and-so did. They care about what you did when they're talking to you. You should really just talk about what you're doing in your life because when you start talking to someone in person, you wanna know what they're doing or they wanna know what you're doing. And it really doesn't matter what someone else is doing in that conversation. And I know that small talk does include uh, little things that you did like, oh yeah, I got out of bed and I took a shower and the water was cold instead of hot or something like that. And it's just kind of a fun story. But overall, small talk can kind of take away from the essence of a really good conversation, which is uh, something a little deeper, like homework. Homework's really important. I need to get my priorities straight. But seriously, there are just so many other things that you can talk about with friends, things that, that you share as far as interests goes or hobbies. But I'm, I mean, I'm not telling you how to guide your conversations, but it's much better when you are more interested in what they are doing or they're interested in what you're doing than when you're trying to talk about things that are happening just that don't really matter. That's not going to change any of your perspectives in life. That's, that's very important that your conversations really draw you to be a good person. <laughs> Another thing I wanted to talk about is mid-conversation when you're, you're just kind of discussing something with somebody and all of a sudden you both stop talking at the same time and I, I know that this happens a lot and then someone just wants to say, awkward? Don't do that first of all, because then you're the one who just like made that extremely awkward. Instead, what you need to do is just imagine yourself like frozen in time, bring yourself out of your body mentally and just observe the two of you in this awkward situation. And if you observe you and the person you're talking to as human beings going for the same goal, which is conversing and kind of being one, give each other a hug, just do it. It'll make you both feel so much better and it'll take away from all awkwardness and you will be buds. Eh. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Thank you, John. <sighs> or if you're acquaintances, you know, they'll just run and you know what? They're acquaintances, so like, pff, who cares? It's not awkward anymore. Well, have a nice day once again if you're in one of those awkward situations just give someone a hug like just don't even tell them why well you know what tell them why tell them that you watched my video and tell them that you should subscribe to my channel uh but thank you very much for watching and just have a wonderful day thanks